Viewer 7 is a free download from Jabs. Viewer 7 is a video viewer that works in conjunction with the recorded sessions from Autolog 7. It can also view other types of files, but viewing Jabs JVL files will allow you to view the associated log in sync with the video playback. This tutorial will cover the general features of Viewer 7. Open Viewer from the icon on your desktop. The Viewer 7 application will open. You can open several types of file formats. Select the File menu item. The open dialogs available are Open Media, Open Log, or Open File Browser. The most common selection used for opening JAVS recorded sessions is the Open Log command. The Open Log command will allow you to open JAVS JVL files, which include the associated log. Select any JVL file and press Open. The session file will open and provide you with audio, video, and the typed log that is associated with the video playback. You can set the video into motion in one of three ways. Clicking on any blue log entry in the event log will advance the playback to that point in time. Using the motion control commands and searching the video manually, or by using the seek bar to navigate in larger steps. The session log is tailored for the particular session, and timestamp links will let you locate individuals being questioned, annotations, direct and redirect of witnesses. Audio channels can be individually adjusted and muted, as well as an overall volume control adjusted or muted. Exhibit files can be added to the Additional Files list. Select the Additional Files tab, and any files associated with the session log will be present. Double-click on any file in the list, and an associated program will open the file. You must have the program that will open the file installed on your computer. A PDF of the event log is also provided. The session name is provided in the seek bar header, as well as the date and current time of day of the video playback. The overall session time is provided at the end of the seek bar, and the current seek bar position is provided at the beginning of the seek bar. The menu items will provide you with all the commands present on the toolbar, and a more detailed help can be found in the user manual located in the help menu item. This concludes the Viewer 7 basic tutorial.